excellent facts about Bill and Ted Face the Music. Metalhead slackers Bill and Ted are making a big movie comeback in 2020 with a third installment to the hit comedy film series Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure in 1989 and Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey in 1991. In Bill and Ted Face the Music, the saga of the time-traveling duo continues, and here are excellent facts about their third on-screen outing. Number 5. It's 8 Years in the Making The idea of a third Bill and Ted movie surfaced in 2010 when one of the film series' lead stars Keanu Reeves indicated that a script was in the works. In April 2011, the other star of the movie, Alex Winter, tweeted that the script had been completed and even dropped a hint about the storyline. When asked about the movie's progress in 2013, Reeves said the two drafts of the script were written and they were waiting for another one. Do like one of those independent press conspiracy, other name, right. kind of explaining why it hasn't happened yet because it's, it's pretty dark. However, the movie couldn't take off from the planning board as screenplay writer Ed Solomon cited issues on getting financing to bankroll the movie because most of those they approached preferred a reboot rather than a sequel. But finally, Scott Krupp, who produced the first two Bill and Ted movies, will also be the producer of the movie, alongside the respected producer and director, Steven Soderbergh. After a long pre-production, shooting for the third installment will begin summer of 2019. What excellent news for the movie series cult following. Number 4. Steven Soderbergh is on board as a producer. Considered one of the most acclaimed and prolific filmmakers of his generation, Steven Soderbergh is executive producing Bill and Ted Face the Music. With his important involvement in the movie, Soderbergh adds prestige to the project and assures audiences of quality entertainment fare. A look at the number of films with his name and expertise attached to them would explain why. Sex Lies and Videotape, Aaron Brockovich, Magic Mike, Ocean's 11, 12, and 13, Logan Lucky, Contagion, and Out of Sight. In the 2001 Academy Awards, Soderbergh received two Best Director nominations for the Julia Roberts star Aaron Brockovich and the crime drama Traffic, which won for him the coveted award. As executive producer, his most recent work was the all-female-led heist movie Ocean's 8. He's been slowly hyping up Bill and Ted Face the Music and told the slam dance attendees in January 2019 that the movie will be hilarious and a love gig for all involved. Number 3. William Sadler reprises his Grim Reaper role Veteran character actor William Sadler first appeared as Death in 1991's Bill & Ted's Bogus Journey, for which he won the Saturn Award for Best Supporting Actor. In the 1991 movie, Bill & Ted are killed by robot doubles who also capture their fiancés. They could go back to life only on one condition, they have to win over the Grim Reaper in a series of games. Not to be outdone, the duo select modern games like Battleship, Clue, and Twister and easily beat Death, who unwillingly becomes their servant. The 2011 draft of the script for the third movie didn't feature the Grim Reaper character, but the screenwriters looked for ways to include him, especially after Sadler's expressed interest to be part of the movie. And yeah, the Grim Reaper makes his way in Bill and Ted face the music. You might be a king or a little street sweeper, but sooner or later you dance with the Reaper. <laughs> Of course, Sadler, who made the character famous, is reprising his role in the 2020 sequel. As to how he encounters Bill and Ted again is something Bill and Ted's followers should look forward to. Number 2. Keanu Reeves and Alex Winter Reunite After 28 Years Keanu Reeves and Alex Winter delightfully welcome their reunion 28 years after they did Bill and Ted's bogus journey in 1991. Since then, a lot has happened to them individually. Reeves gained international stardom in 1994's surprise blockbuster Speed opposite Sandra Bullock in the science fiction action series The Matrix and in the John Wick franchise in recent years. He displayed his versatility in different genres such as the psychological thriller The Devil's Advocate, the horror action film Constantine, and the romantic drama The Lake House. Although Winner hasn't reached leading man status, he has continually pursued acting, writing, directing, and producing for film and television. Among his notable works are the documentaries Deep Web, The Untold Story of Bitcoin and the Silk Road, Trump's Lobby, and the Panama Papers, and in the Ben 10 TV movies. To herald their reunion, Reeves and Winter appeared in a brief announcement video saying, We owe you a huge debt of gratitude, and we wanted to say thank you, and be excellent. And it is all because of you guys, and so we owe you a huge debt of gratitude, and we wanted to say thank you. Thank you. 
and be excellent. Be excellent. Number one, the sequel story revolves around middle-aged Bill and Ted. Screenwriter Ed Solomon explained in 2018 that the reason it took so long for the production of Bill and Ted Face the Music to start was because the team worked hard for years to get the story and script right. They've done many revisions before coming up with a screenplay that they're really proud of. He further said, this is not, hey, let's all cash in on the Bill and Ted thing for money. This is the opposite. This is, we love these characters. They've been with us for our whole lives. And so, the heavy metal music loving buddies are teaming up again as middle-aged William Bill S. Preston Esquire and Theodore Ted Logan. They set out on a new adventure to fulfill their rock and roll destiny, which someone from the future has warned them. That is, Bill and Ted are to write music that has the power to bring harmony to the universe. Along the way, they'll be helped out by their families, old pals, and a few music legends. As Solomon assures, it will be really fun and funny and sweet. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video with your friends and subscribe to our channel for your daily dose of voodoo videos.